CDC revealed that the U.S. infant mortality rate rose last year for the first time in two decades. March of Dimes is an organization that uses research, advocacy, and education to help give mothers and babies the best possible start in life. The organization gives out a report card each year to every state on maternal care. KNWA's Christina Randall is in studio to tell us how Arkansas ranked on that report card. Christina. Now, in a March of Dimes released its 22 report card, uh, states are graded on how many babies are born before they reach their full term. Now, if you can like look right behind me, there are some that are in red, and Arkansas is one of those states, and that means that they got an F grade. Not only that, but officials with March of Dimes says more than 40% of Arkansas counties are considered maternity care deserts. So, Arkansas has a higher an average um, percentage of counties that are maternity care desert. Counties classified as being a maternity care desert means there is no hospital or birth center offering obstetric care in those areas. 16% of women have no birthing hospital within 30 minutes, and that's much higher than the U.S. average, around 9%. According to Honor McDaniel with March of Dimes, being so far away from prenatal care is bad for both the mom and baby's health. Let's say the nearest place is 30 minutes away, right, for her to get her care. She now has to think through, how am I going to get time off work, right? How am I going to find child care if I have other kids? I need to make sure I have reliable transportation. McDaniel says if a mother is high risk of having complications during pregnancy, she will have to get prenatal care more often. She has cardiovascular issues, maybe hypertension or diabetes, or she smokes, right? All of those things can put a woman at higher risk. Arkansas infant mortality rate is at 7.3%. According to March of Dimes 2022 report, the nation's infant mortality rate is at 5.4%. The report also shows preterm birth rates in Arkansas is at 12%, which is also raising some questions. Are moms able to get access to prenatal care? Is it good prenatal care that they're getting? Are they getting the information that they need to be healthy during their pregnancy? But also, are they healthy before they're pregnant? Despite the maternal care challenges Arkansas has, McDaniel says the organization is seeing progress. It's great that Arkansas has expanded Medicaid. Um, we're also looking, can we extend postpartum Medicaid beyond 60 days? Because we, we have moms who, who get pregnant or who um, don't get healthy right after their pregnancy. McDaniel says the leading cause of infant death in Arkansas is birth defects and preterm birth. In our state, the preterm birth rate among black women is 46% higher than any other ethnicity group. In studio, Christina Randall, KNWA, Northwest Arkansas News.